31 Buick, straight eight. All original. I'll tell you what, this is a good way to start on a street ride. Get all the steel. Definitely. And it looks like he starts it up too. It's a nice 65 wagon. Five Coronet 440 station wagon 160,000 AC car 318 automatic 17.5 oboe that looks nice it's solid too Door closes good. Look at that front end. I'll tell you what, that's a nice one, guys. Glass is nice. That curved glass is hard to get right there. I know that. Both sides are good. Yep. Great looking wagon. Not a bad price. The 62 Impala. Well, they got. 62 Impala, 350, three speed, new battery tires, fuel tank, fuel filter, 15 fiber, best offer. Cash is king. Call or text. If you got cash, that means you got a king. Good looking Impala. Two C10 for sale. What I got? Ninety-five hundred. Two seven zero eight three two nine three three one. Call Wayne. Bunch of brand new stuff. Don't look too bad. Well, fifty-six Ford. Six Ford F three fifty V eight four speed not running twenty five hundred title is here six three seven two nine nine seven four zero two all right forty five hundred. Thing's solid, I know that. It's real solid. Definitely solid. 
Looks like like the only burger on it right there. This thing's real solid. Man. This will sell. Chevy. Seven zero three three nine seven nine three six for a forty eight Chevy three thirty one hundred at thirty five People have been looking at this thing all day. Twenty two K. There is no phone number. Talk about an old farm truck. Yeah, it's still got the weeds in the thing. <laughs> <laughs> this thing loaded with patina wow Don't see no price or anything no info check out this old it's a dodge 37 maybe yeah it's a dodge check this out that's pretty cool i like the wheels looks like it's got new paint i don't know we got 16 grand oh yep 37 dodge s10 front yeah s10 rear 350 350 runs moves and stops all right runs 
runs, moves and starts. Probably needs brakes and stuff finished up. There's the phone number. What else does Dodge need? Oh, that's next door. I don't know who. Alrighty. <laughs> So wagon's cool. Old 63 Pontiac Catalina. Catalina's really cool. The Pontiac had it going on back then, didn't they? 3D9 tri-power, AC, power steering, power brakes, AM, FM, electric windows. All factory numbers matching, 16 OBO. And it looks solid too. Nice car. Man, I tell you what, they didn't make them like they used to. They don't make them like they used to. Nice car. It's all solid. Close is good. Cool car. Old 1950 cab over. I'll tell you what, these cab overs have gotten popular. I always, always liked them. I liked them back when they weren't cool. And could have picked one up for cheap back in the day. But I didn't. I like the lights up there, the running lights. Nice touch. Nice touch. I'll tell you what, this would be a good one for a uh, person running parts or hauling cars or got a yard or a lot. I'm not seeing a price on these two. I don't know, maybe they already sold. Or we just got here. Thirty-nine Ford Deluxe. Well, you don't see these too often done up with street rods in a four door. Pretty sweet. Beautiful paint job. It's almost like a candy apple red, but it's not. Beautiful car. Good looking 34. Always like these. These are one of my favorites right here. 24,000.
original steel. Oh yeah, this is cool. This is a duty. 40, 40, Studebaker, 41. It's all original. see that stuff no more well this thing's sweet I don't know if it's for sale I don't see a price on it this is already sold Old Dodge I guarantee you this thing's been done since 80s maybe 36 Dodge 350 700R ice cold air. There's phone number. And I don't know, maybe not the 80s, but maybe the 90s. This kind of looks like a style. It's like an older build, but it's in great shape. Paint's beautiful. Absolutely gorgeous. Oh. Good looking car. No thirty eight Chevy. Selling air today because it's hotter than heck. <laughs> Pretty green. It's a good looking car. Got a phone number? There's a phone number. Silverado truck. We'll show it. It's here. 84.
looks like an older build, doesn't it? That neon on the paint. Not a bad price though, 15. 30. Not a bad price. I'm digging on this 62 Oldsmobile. This thing's sweet. Rag top. She is sweet. Another Impala. A few Impalas out here for sale. thousand dollars for this bug a lot of people looking at this willies this morning Also, got a 350 in it. it. Says the color is an O2, hardly purple. Ghost flames. So there's the phone number. Looks like he wants 42,000 for it. Oh, there's the ghost flames. I see him. Team for the old Chevy. Forty seven Chevy, two seven oh, six oh four oh seven three six. Let's get a rear view of these two cars. A lot of hills here. Sorry for all the bumps and got wiped out a few times. Little truck over here for sale. This must be for sale row right through here. One eighty five hundred for the six to three. The uh, Joel Tri Power. I like that car. Fifty-seven four convertible, twenty-eight thousand. There's the phone number. It's 
nice. They probably feed you lunch if you buy it. Sandwich stuff. Lemon cookies. <laughs> I love lemon cookies. There we go. Here's a wild one for sale. This is 14 grand oboe. This thing's wild. Check it out. Good looking 49 now. Gotta like yellow though. This thing's done right. There's prices on them. I was wondering if they were sold or not. Got a title. Uh, excellent hood, but it's in his garage. Comforts the trim in his house. Well, there's the number. I showed these earlier. I was gonna come back to them to see if they were sold or not. The guy says, oh no, I haven't priced them yet. I guess both cars are 5100. He won't split them up. Interesting. Alrighty. Huh. So there you go. We got 5100 on both of them? Yeah. How's come you're not gonna split them up? Because I'll get stuck with one. Get stuck with one? Which yeah. one do you think you get stuck with? I don't know. You don't know? <laughs> I don't care. No, I mean, I got all the parts for both of them. Yeah. The guy be a fool enough to take them both. 70 oh. years old. Where are you gonna find the part? Okay. I'm sorry if I'm out of. No, I'm just curious. Where you out of? Okay. Where are you at? Louisville. 
It's close to you. How far will you deliver? Oh, I don't know. I have to think about it. After I sell it, I'll think about it. Okay. Well, that's fair. I could get it delivered probably. Just curious. Alrighty. I sold a car one time and I gave a guy a delivered price and he kept it. I like that two door. That two door is nice. Yeah. It's my great frog folly story. I said that he kept bragging how much money he had. He was going to pay me. Yeah, they all. never have money, do they? And then when I get brag. down there and he wanted to give me a check number 100. Yeah. See, said, I'm broke. No, I said, I'll, I'll send you the title when the check comes. Yeah. Oh, no, no. So then he had to rob his kid to pay me. Yeah, usually when they brag, they're broke. What does? What's the story on this here two door? Has it got an engine? Flathead six. Okay. Honestly, I bought it for all the parts for this one. Okay. I mean. Yeah, two doors cool. Alrighty. Perfect hood in my garage. You know, I'm Yeah. It's it's been on my garage in my garage ever since I pulled the motor out. Yeah. And um I saw no reason to pull it over here and let it blow off. Yeah. Alrighty. I'll tell you what. Money talks. I know it. Thank you. Alright, there's a row of cars here. They're all for sale. Just the price. No information. No nothing. Like that truck's 5500 That's 67 for sale. That's all it says. For sale. Oh, there's not even prices on them. They just say for sale. I don't know guys, these are here for sale, this one doesn't say anything but I can't look at it too long, it reminds me of a creamsicle, no 48 Dodge, I don't know, can I rant for a minute? If I get some hate uh, comments or whatever, it doesn't matter. My rant is. Hold on a second. You're all right. All kids like them four wheel drives, don't they? The tire. Can you imagine how big that is to them? If it was big, big to us, the big old monster truck. Talk about that big Jeep right there kids want to mess with it all right my rant is them cars over there that uh just say for sale and you got to put a price on it or put some information at least at least at least put a phone number on there just don't put the words for sale i don't know and there's no one around the vehicles either there's my other thing no one's around it you just got for sale no price no phone number no info no nothing that's my rant Put some info on it, people. I don't know if you agree, you agree. If you disagree, let me know down below if you disagree. I'll tell you what, I keep coming back to this one for patina. I build a lot of models. If you guys want to see some model building, there's there's model building on my channel. This is some great reference for uh, patina because I like weathering my models. It reminds me, if you uh, dig this content, Make sure you subscribe because there's plenty of other content like this on the channel. Like I said, including model building. We build models in the winter and I like weathering them like this. Pretty cool patina. What we got there? No hot rod. Got chassis here. You gonna buy that? No, I'm gonna take a look at it though. Yeah. I'll look at it later. Too hot to look at it right now. Boy, it is, isn't it? Oh, 
complete chassis. And again, there's the info. Thirty-six hundred with a phone number. There's a fifty Ford for sale. There's phone number. Imagine that phone number price and some info on it. Hmm. What was I complaining about five minutes ago? Anyway. 95% rust free. It saves a lot of work. Flathead V8, I'll, I'll let you guys read it. Alright. Let's see what's around the back here on this. Looks like it's a brand new bed. Fifty-five, man, it's looking good. I showed that earlier. That's just a cool picture right there. It's hard to beat a fifty-five. Hard to beat a five. In case you missed it, we'll show it again. There's the phone number. And he's got 22 oboe on it. We didn't look inside it earlier. The one with the new floorboards. I think I showed this at the Tri Five Nationals. I think I think I did. Oh, he's selling his tow vehicle too. So this is for sale. There's phone number. Call PJ. PJ probably make you a package deal. How much PJ went on this tow vehicle? Uh oh, no price. So I don't know. Maybe uh, the tow vehicle ain't for sale. I don't know. Gotta call PJ and ask. What else we got? Got a 65 Nova. That bad boy's black. Sweet. 65 Nova. Russell. There you go, Russell. Russell's got some nice handwriting. Oh, it's silver on top. All right. Let's take a look at this thing. All right, Russell. Oh man, I'm digging this 442. Woo, that sucker's nice. Red, ready. Man, that thing's sweet. Look at that 442, guys. Wow. Ooh, the interior is just as nice, too. Let's see if they got a price. Thing. Sweet. All right, let's see what we got here. Yeah, 49 now. New paint, body perfect. There's the phone number 217 415 6544. Matching number engine 4000 on the rebuild. It's a 1971, five speed. Man, that's sweet. Ooh. What we got over here? This one's sold. I saw this come in earlier and people were all over it. I didn't get a chance to show it because there was people everywhere on it. 
I mean, there was like 10 people looking at it. I couldn't film it because I didn't want to film backs, backs and butts. But evidently it sold. She's a sold. Here's a car that's kind of dear to my heart. This 53 Mercury. I had a 54 Ford Crestline that I really enjoyed. It was a six cylinder car. This 53 Mercury is nice. Interior looks good. Always like the glass on these. That's got the Continental kit. Wasn't a fan of the Continental kit, but hey, skirts with it. It's a good looking Merc. Again, it reminds me a lot of my 54. I like this green color, this pea green and this green. Got the spotlights on it. Oh, good looking car. 53 Merc. 14.5 or trade or best offer. There's the phone number 270-703-1401. I do believe this is a pretty good buy, guys.